What's up guys, Bilingual Duelist here and today I'm going to crack my BGS 9.5 Dark Magician Girl here and send it to ARS. Hey guys, welcome back and as you have heard it guys, I'm going to crack my BGS 9.5 Dark Magician Girl to send to ARS and I will tell you exactly why I did that in the video and of course you will also get the submission back and see what she got here as an ARS card. Alright guys, let's check her out really quickly here and yeah, this is a Dark Magician Girl in the 20th anniversary secret rare style and yeah it's a card i really really like it's a very very unique rarity the 20th anniversary cards just look very very nice and yeah it's basically a starlight rare but it has the 20th emblem here embedded and yeah they were just released in japan no other languages got these and yeah this card here got actually a 9.5 in centering edges and surface and the corners got the 9 and i already told you guys how the card was obtained and it was in a dvd and you had these small silver bags in there and yeah they got damaged in these small bags very very frequently and um, yeah the corners are the issue on this card and actually um, they gave her a nine in corners so the corners here are actually um, not perfect but they are also not bad on camera it's always very difficult to show but yeah as you can see the card um, has no major widening on any of the edges or corners and this is why i think this could actually cross to an ars 10 and yeah ARS is the Japanese grading service and I really think that this card deserves an ARS slab because yeah just look at this very cloudy looking uh, bagged case here my girl deserves better for sure and yeah I'm going to crack this open now and yeah let's check out how she looks raw and if she looks good also in raw condition then let's send her in and let's see what she actually got so I always put like a small plastic bag around the card because um, I'm not wearing glasses and sometimes the acrylic is like flying around when you crack it and yeah I don't want anything in my eyes so yeah let's start maybe with that corner over here and yeah see you guys in a second okay guys I cracked her here's the label again and yeah she is still in her little plastic bag here so yeah let's check her out again once I open this up and this video actually is I think very important so I will make sure that I actually keep the condition on camera as good as possible because there is just not many reviews for ARS grades and yeah certainly uh, if there would be any there would be in Japanese so yeah this is something uh, very important guys let's check out how they grade by of course looking exactly uh, how the condition of this Dark Magician Girl is alright I got myself some scissors now and yeah let's slowly put push the card down here a little bit in the little sleeve here and yeah let's start to cut open this sleeve here from Beckett let's see if this was enough already yes let's get some sleeve ready okay guys let's check the condition of this 9.5 Dark Magician Girl and yeah I'm not expecting to see anything on the surface even though it was a 9.5 and not a 10 because these modern cards usually are flawless so as you can see it is a flawless card all corners are very very nicely cut here and there's also no scratches on the foil let me know if you see anything but I think the the front is pristine here okay and the difficult part is of course the backside because the yeah, Yu-Gi-Oh corners are also white colored so it makes it harder for the camera to actually pick up any whitening so what I can see here for this corner here actually is that it is a little bit weakened maybe just a little bit but it is not like bent or something and this corner over here also looks good to me let's check the back surface so there is no scratches on the back obviously very clean and the corner here also no issues with this this is probably the best corner on the card 
and finally the right bottom corner and I think there is some widening but very very minor so yeah this is probably as good as it gets for this card here guys because yeah it is just unfortunate how they packaged it up but yeah this is how it turned out and so there is some kind of a chase to get the 10 for her and yeah i will send this card into ars and for you guys it will be a couple of seconds but for me it will be a couple of weeks all right guys and there we are now three weeks have passed and yeah i just recorded my ars opening i didn't check the grade for the dark magician girl yet but yeah i am super excited the opening of the whole ars return will go live very very soon but first we will check out the dark magician girl did she cross from a BGS 9.5 to an ARS 10? Let's see. Okay guys, so there we go guys. This is how she looks right now. And isn't this a m way more fitting case guys? What do you think? I think there was no other way than going with ARS. I mean PSA, no way. BGS, definitely not. CGC, maybe but i'm not a fan of the label cgc labels look a little bit outdated to me so yeah no way i'm going to send that to cgc so yeah ars it is so beautiful guys and look how clean everything is here and yeah final reminder we had here the centering 9.5 corners 9 surface 9.5 hedges 9.5 so it's not a quad 9.5 <sighs> did she get the 10 let's find out guys three two one yes we got the 10 guys ars 10 dark magician girl 20th anniversary secret rare a card that will always be in my collection will never leave again it crossed from the 9.5 to an ars 10 which is super awesome and guys like I said ARS is not giving out these tents for free they are actually quite harsh and yeah you have to make sure that the corners and edges are super super clean if there is some corner damaged a little bit of whitening you're usually not getting the 10 and yeah we managed to get the Dark Magician Girl 20th Anniversary Secret Rare in an ARS 10 I couldn't be happier guys this is so cool I love this looks so nice the trophy look guys it's just a perfect slap for this beautiful card you guys and yeah the whole opening of my air submission is going live next week I guess so yeah if you don't want to miss that and I'm pretty sure if you've watched until yet you are definitely not going to want to miss that subscribe to my channel leave a like comment your thoughts here under the video and yeah let's meet again very very soon in a huge submission of 17 more ARS cards I graded myself. Hope you enjoyed, see you very soon, your bilingual duelist, ciao!